I'm Kylie. I represent Little South. Um, and this is my poem titled, Why I Don't Walk Home Anymore. Leaving Math by Miss Garcia, turning the corner, walking down the dull off-white stairs, watching as the tiny rocks that fill the walls pass me by as I move mindlessly through the cluttered halls, nameless faces, boring conversations, uncomfortably warm bodies surrounding me, suffocating me. I make it down the stairs. We used to meet here, now you meet her here instead. I walk past you, pretending I don't see, pretending I don't feel anymore. Walking down the hallway, or rather floating, pretending I'm not there, trying to navigate these hallways that I've always intensely hated now, even more because of you. Passing brick after brick, concentrating on the color-filled posters that hang in little neat rows upon the stone walls. I wonder why they're there. I glance at the room around me and then wonder, why do I even try anymore? I walk out of the front doors. Why is it so cold outside? We used to heat huddle with each other over by that corner. I refuse to view the place that we used to sit and wait for our acquaintances that walked with us, snuggling and hand-holding to pass the time. I start down the way we used to walk. I took this path with you every day for months, and then for the last time on that fateful day when I stormed away from you so you wouldn't see me crying. I stare at the cement tiles as they move from in front of to behind me while I power walk, but no matter how fast I go, the memories follow. They haunt me. I can't run away from my own mind. I can't run away from you through the trees and to the left. You told me once that cutting through the apartments is faster than walking all the way around, and now I can't go any other way. I peer through the windows of the apartments, looking at the window art, hoping it could possibly distract me, even if just momentarily. Cat stickers, Black Lives Matter, Confederate flags, Christmas lights, don't tread on me, love is love, grab them by the patriarchy. I see the sign so often that the sight now means nothing to me. I turn my head, my boredom and sadness now simmering into exhaustion. I count the garage spaces, then count the squares on the patterns of each and every door, then count the red cars, gray cars, blue cars, white cars. Sometimes there's even some blacks on the road if I'm lucky. I miss the conversations we had on these walks. This used to be my favorite part of the day, and now I hate this obnoxiously monotonous task. I listen to the cars pass in the distance, then to the breeze causing the leaves to blow around on the ground lightly, some leaves falling from the trees and joining the endless heaps of red, orange, yellow, and green that are now always under my feet. It is so cold. I get to where you and I used to part ways. I tried so hard not to break down before I got home that day. I felt like a basket case just sitting there and sobbing while cars kept stopping to ask if I was okay. Why did I let you hurt me that once I'm on the other side, I instinctively grab my phone and open my contacts. Never mind, I can't call you anymore. I wish I didn't want to. I wish I didn't want you. I shove my phone back in my pocket and continue observing the scene of what used to be one of my happiest memories. Never again will I be reminded of why I don't walk home anymore. <laughs>